Hello, my acquaintances, and welcome to uh, to episode two. Yes, I am now naming them episodes because I feel like it. Uh, just not in my opinion, it sounds better than part. So yeah. So welcome to episode two of my let's play for the Legend of Zelda: Ocarina of Time, a game that totally has never been let's played before. Let's get back into it. We were right in the middle of a conversation with a Deku Tree when we ended off. Um, yeah, so he's gonna open his big mouth, so... That's a big ass mouth. <coughs> so the Deku Tree here is our very first uh, dungeon of the game. I was about to say temple, it's not a temple. It's our first dungeon of the game. The first three dungeons are dungeons, and then after that, they're all temples. Um, I really hate it when people call a call a dungeon a temple. I don't know why. It's just a <coughs> part of me. It's just a bit of a, a pet peeve of mine for all pretty much for all Zelda games, especially Ocarina of Time. Ocarina of Time, in my opinion, is the worst. I don't know why, but people always tend to call the first three dungeons temples. <coughs> Should we kill our first enemy? Yeah, I need Deku sticks actually. I don't know. I don't know why I didn't get any. All right, let's kill this bitch. Get our first Deku stick. Uh, let's put that to one of our C buttons, and let's go find more Deku sticks because we need some Deku sticks. Oh, what the fuck? He didn't. Hmm. All right. And we got a Deku Nut, the... probably the most useless item in the whole game. You will not be... you will not see me be using this even once. I just do not use it at all. In my opinion, it's just incredibly useless, but... Okay, you may see me use it once in the third dungeon, but... After that, you're not gonna see me use it at all, ever. Eh. Thank you. Navi is so fucking annoying. Well, in my opinion, Navi is not quite as annoying as people make her out to be, but... You'll see why people always make fun of her if you've never played this game before and you keep watching. <gasps> it's our first chest in the first dungeon! That makes our second chest in the game! I wonder what's inside. My leg hurts. What the fuck? It's the dungeon map! Press start to get into the subscreen and look at the map subscreen. Yeah, yeah, I'm not gonna be using the dungeon maps. I don't know the dungeon. Whoa! What was that? I did not mean to do that. Anyways, as I was saying, I will not be using any of the dungeon maps. I will be collecting them, but I won't get them. Because I know the dungeons too well. And. Well, I'll just show you. Personally, I don't think that's very, I don't think they're very helpful in this game. In other Zelda games, yes, they're very helpful. This game, not so much. I don't know what it is about them. I just don't like them. All right. And now here's Nov telling us how to open a fucking door. I'm pretty sure we know how to open a door, Nov. Yeah, I have arms. Thank you very much. They may be sure a little stubby. Polygon Nintendo 64 arms, but they're still arms. Shut up. Okay, and that is a Deku scrub, is it? That's some kind of scrub. Uh, it might be a Deku scrub. And that's talking about rolling if we jump from high. Jump from really high. If you jump from really high and you roll before you hit the ground, then you don't take any damage. It's just a little tip for you guys that the Deku scrub's telling me. <laughs> and that's it. The next door opens, and we get to go in. <coughs> Uh, alright, let's go. Um, I got, got a little donut with me here, so I'm gonna take a bite of this. I love donuts. Yes, yes, yes. Okay, 
If you are in need of a heart, or at least I believe that's a heart, then you can climb up these vines, and there is a little chest up here, which I believe has a recovery heart. If not, it's rubies. Yes, it's a recovery heart. So if you're in need of a heart, just go up there. And now we are to uh, equip the fairy slingshot. Nobody ever calls it the fairy slingshot. Everyone just calls it the slingshot. And using the fairy slingshot, we have to shoot down that ladder. And then we get to climb up. <laughs> Ow, my throat. Anyways, let's continue on. Die, you son of a bitch! Whoa, whoa, lag, lag, lag. And Deku's seeds are our bullets that we use for the fairy slingshot. It's pretty much our ammunition. But it's not a gun, so it's not the right word, but whatever, I don't give a shit. I like the word ammunition. No, no, no let's see what he drops first. No, oh, whatever, it's just a Deku, Deku nut. It's just the nuts of a Deku scrub, I don't want that. So, do you guys think I'll be able to finish the... Um, the the, um, <clears throat> the Deku tree before the video's over? I don't know, we're already about seven minutes in. And we haven't even broken through the web yet. We'll see, though. Okay, this room is... Ah. Just light this quickly. Hey! Thank you. Hey, 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 hey! Oof, I think a little hard to control on the keyboard, even though it's like 60% of the time I play this game now is on the keyboard. <laughs> or lately, anyways. Kind of. Well, I don't know. I've been playing a lot on the 3DS. Well, not a lot, a lot. I have about 60 hours. 60 hours of gameplay of it on the 3DS. Which I guess is a fair amount, but... <clears throat> I only have one complete save. One, one complete file. On it, and it's a, one, it's a totally 100%. I think so. Let's see if we can get some Deku sticks. Right here. Thank you. Oh, no. Oh. These guys aren't giving me Deku sticks. It's not fair. <laughs> okay, now we have to watch out for this Skultula here. Whoa, 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 whoa. There we go. Just jump around it. And this is our first gold, gold skull tool of the game. Do not touch it. If you touch it, it will do a whole heart of damage to you. And that is a lot when you only have three hearts. So. And yes, that skull tool there gl always glitches up. And like stomp the wall. And there is another recovery heart if you suck at this game and need it. Okay, now that we have our compass, which I personally didn't need... But, I was just going to show it to you guys anyways. We come out here. Jump attack him, because doing jump attacks is twice as powerful as a normal jump. Oh, not normal jump, jump, normal attack, sorry. Oh. And we break the web. I always like doing a jump attack when I get close to the web. And just in this room alone, we have two more gold school tulas that we can collect. Oh, oh, oh. Bada bing, bada boom. There's the first one, and the second one is... Not fun to get. <laughs> so we have to climb that line there. And once again, if you suck at this game, you can come over here, open this chest, and get another heart piece. Uh, not piece. Oh, I wish it was a heart piece. A recovery heart. Okay, we're about 10 minutes into the video. I doubt I'll be able to finish the... The... The Deku Tree. Yes. I always forget his name, because he's so fucking old. Makes me feel old, too. I guess. No, that's what, that's my assumption. 
Okay, that. Now we have a total of three gold, gold skull tulas. Jump on a little platform here because if you go in the water with a Deku stick on fire, it will light out. Put the Deku stick away quickly so you save it. Because I only have one right now. Two. Sorry, I have two now. I'm not, this is. I think this is the lowest I've ever ran on Deku sticks in the in the Deku tree. <laughs> Alright, uh, now this Deku Scrub tells us how to, which order to hit three Deku Scrubs that we are going to run into later in the dungeon. The order is 2, 3, 1, 23 is number 1, blah blah blah, gonna take another bite of my donut. I think I just hit the, the mic, I'm very sorry. And once again, if you suck, he leaves you another recovery arm. I, though, do not suck, so I do not need the recovery hair. Thank you very much. I remember the very first time I played Zelda Master Quest. Oh, I got stuck in this room for like a couple days. And all my friends were laughing at me because I kept telling them I was stuck in the Deku Tree. Then I finally figured out a way, which, fortunately, you'd think it would work in this version, but it doesn't. Maybe the water's a little higher. I mean, maybe the water's like a tad lower in the Master Quest version or something. I don't know. Well, I'm not gonna rate that. Actually, I might have, but I just pussied out. I'll just wait for it to come back. Well, I, I, there we go. Sorry, I probably just blow your eardrums. I, but I needed to clear my throat, so. I always need to clear my throat, I don't know why. And that hurt me out. Crap. Uh, well, I was hoping to go through the Deku Tree taking no damage, but that just ruined it. Blah, 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 whatever. I, I keep my fails in video, whatever. Even if it's a fail that takes up a whole episode, as you've seen in a couple of my Super Mario 64 Let's Play episodes. Whatever. And hopefully one of these has like, a heart or something. Yes, and some ammunition for our fairy slingshot. Thank you very much. I don't know, I'm bored. Well, I'm not bored because I'm playing my favorite game, but like, I don't, I don't know what to compensate at this exact moment. Okay, in, never mind. I thought this was the room where we had to shoot the eggs off the ceiling. Now this guy, I don't know. He's like a fucking dildo or something. He doesn't even come down. And that is another two Deku sticks for us. Eh. I could get more, but I don't need any more, so. Hey, you. Light on fire, thank you. Thank you very much. I appreciate that. Yeah, I'm not gonna beat the Dagger Tree in this episode. We only have a minute left. And this guy starts with his back turned to us, so we can just sh shoot him and he won't know a thing. Now, these eggs on the ceiling, when you walk into the middle of the room, these eggs will hatch and spawn little creatures. But if you shoot a little above the eggs, you can't shoot you can't shoot at the egg, because that, for some reason, doesn't work. But if you shoot a little bit above the egg, then it will kill the egg. I've always, I always have a little bit of trouble with this one. Whatever. I don't have the time for this. Let's just kill it. It spawns these little creatures. Which are very, very easy to kill. Okay, now you have two ways to go. You can light a Deku stick and go in there, but then you'll find a path, your path blocked by a door. That can only be, be destroyed by bombs. And you, you don't get bombs until the second dungeon, so we will we will be coming back after the second dungeon. And I will show you what is in there. But for now, I must end this episode because it is at 15 minutes. This is Dragony. I will see you guys later. 
good day to you.